Hey, what's up, you guys? WWE fan 0599 here again, and today we're going to review Steve Jobs. So, Steve Jobs stars Michael Fassbender, Kate Winslet, Seth Rogen, and Jeff Daniels. And what this film is about, it's about, you know, Steve Jobs. Basically, it's taken us behind the scenes of what happened during these three major events that happened in Steve Jobs' life. One that happened in 1984, which was for the Macintosh. One in 1988 about this, like, cute, like, this cube-type computer thing. And in 1998 about the iMac. So, we're basically seeing what happened behind the scenes of all three of these events. So, yeah. So, what did I think of Steve Jobs. People, why didn't you go see this movie when it was in theaters? This movie's amazing. This movie's incredible. How dare you? I'm, I'm being serious. How dare you m not see this film? This film bombed. Why? This movie is fantastic. I loved Steve Jobs. It's an absolutely incredible film. So yeah. So let's get into my positives of Steve Jobs, and my positives are the acting with the film. The acting is tremendous with this movie. I love the acting with this film. Michael Fassbender is absolutely incredible as Steve Jobs. You know, he may not look like Steve Jobs. I know a lot of people have been like, oh, he doesn't really look like Steve Jobs. That doesn't matter to me. As long as you can give a great, great, great performance, then you're good by me. And man, does he give an amazing performance as Steve Jobs, because he embodies Steve Jobs. He, like, embodies Steve Jobs. He captures the personality of Steve Jobs, and it's great, and you can definitely see that shining on screen, you know, and it's just great. And I loved Michael Fassbender as Steve Jobs. I thought Kate Winslet was great in the film as well. She should definitely get a supporting actress nomination. She was absolutely fantastic in this film. Oh yeah, Michael Fassbender no doubt will get deserves an um best actor award. He really does, no doubt about it. And you know, just Kate Winslet was fantastic in the film. She did such an incredible job. Uh, Seth Rogen was really good in the film. I thought he did a really good job as well. Jeff Daniels. Jeff Daniels, my boy. He was awesome as well. I loved him in this film. Um, I just thought he did an absolutely great job as well. So, yeah. Um, also, the, um, each of the people that played the little girl, you know, his daughter, Lisa, throughout the years, I thought they all did a great job as well, you know, playing each individual one throughout the years. I thought they were good as well. So, yeah. I loved seeing the whole behind the scenes of what happened during these events. It was so intriguing because, you know, Steve Jobs you know, was kind of a jerk sometimes. I'm being honest. Steve Jobs was kind of a jerk. He really was, you know. He wanted everything to be perfect. Everything just to be on the spot perfect, really, you know. And you definitely see that. And he, he would just be mean to co-workers, you know, but... Everything, mostly everything he did would turn out to be perfection, sort of, you know. So, yeah. And, uh, I just like seeing the whole behind the scenes with it and everything. That was great, so yeah. The whole relationship with him and his daughter I thought was great as well. I thought that was great between him and his daughter. That was great seeing, you know. Um, I really enjoyed seeing that. That was great, in my opinion. Some of the best stuff in the entire film. Um, the ending. Now, I'm not going to spoil it, of course, but I thought the ending just wrapped everything up so perfectly like like a bow you know it wrapped everything like a nice bow and i thought that just was great honestly i loved how the film just ended and on a great note in my opinion so i just like how they wrapped everything up so yeah um the writing the writing with the film is absolutely tremendous it's written by aaron sorkin who's probably one of the best writers working today he does so so great with the writing here. The dialogue is so great between each and every character. You know, but the back and forth between you know Steve jo between Steve Jobs and Kate Winslet's character, I love that. That was great. You know, seeing the back and forth between Steve Jobs and, and uh, uh, you know, and Aaron Sork. Uh, no, not Aaron Sork. I'm sorry. Um, uh, but Seth Rogen's character. I know it started with an A, but he was you know seeing their back and forth was great as well. I thought I love that. That was great as well. So yeah, the writing by Aaron Sork is absolutely great. 
The directing by Danny Boyle is absolutely fantastic as well. I love the directing by Danny Boyle. He does an absolutely tremendous job directing this film. So, the pacing. The pacing is great, actually. You know, it was going like that. Like, like this. It was, it was going so fast. Like, not to the point where it was rushing. Like, not where it was rushing the film. It was just nice, smooth pacing. I wasn't bored throughout the entire film. I wasn't bored for a second, so yeah. My only complaint, my only negative with Steve Jobs is the woman that plays the mother of, you know, Steve Jobs' you know, uh, child, you know, the mother of Lisa. She, I'm sorry, she was awful. She really was. She was terrible in the scenes that she had. She was overacting, being over dramatic. She was just overselling it. She really was. And it was kind of bad to watch on screen sometimes. It really was. Um, you know, I just didn't enjoy her whenever she was on screen. It was just awful to watch. It really was. So, yeah. That's my only negative with Steve Jobs. So, yeah. So, Steve Jobs is an absolutely incredible film. I don't know why it didn't, enough people didn't go see this while I was in theaters. You people, why? Just why? You make films like Transformers make money, but you don't let this movie make any money. So, but yeah. But it's time to give my official grade on Steve Jobs. And my official grade on Steve Jobs is an A. It's an absolutely incredible film. I loved it. You know, just go and see this movie, please. It's, just go and see it. It's absolutely incredible. I loved it. So it's getting an A. So what did you guys think of Steve Jobs? Leave in the comment section below. And I'm WWE Fan 0599. And we'll see you out later. Peace.